my channel, make sure to hit the subscribe button down below to become an official Lex Babe and join the Lex Babe fam. But today's video is going to be a super requested video, and I've been procrastinating on this video for quite a bit. Um, it has been like two weeks since I've been procrastinating to film it and edit it and just upload it for you guys. But it is a how to get and stay fit um, for the new year. I know it is almost February, but it's we're still in the new year here. Um, but I just wanted to show you guys my tips and tricks and just uh, DIYs and you know, my favorite workouts and just things like that. I'm just going to be showing you guys a bunch of different stuff that I like to do to get and stay fit. If you guys want to see another fitness video in spring and summer, make sure to give this video a big thumbs up and comment that down below. Also, I'm showing you guys a food, you know, DIY. And if you guys want any other healthy food ideas, I will have a link down below to the article I wrote for healthy snacks on my blog. It is actually really helpful and they are so delicious, might I add. Um, and yeah, so also make sure to stick tuned till the end of the video. Um, after I do like all the montage of like the workouts and DIYs and stuff like that, I will be doing a tips and tricks like section where I tell you guys my top five tips and tricks so make sure to stay tuned for that and yeah so if you like this video obviously give it a big thumbs up and without further ado let's go ahead and jump into the video do you recall not long ago we would walk on the sidewalk in the sand remember so what you're going to do first is take those index cards and cut them into strips. You can use index cards or really any type of colorful paper that you would like to use. You can also use scrapbook paper as well. And just cut those into about 4 inch strips and then you will be left with this. Now I already bought a mason jar that had a sticker on it. Now you can add these if you want and just put workouts on it. And then um, what I also did was went on Pinterest and looked at pictures and uh, different workouts that you can do and it had like the number of workouts and like things like that so I think that is definitely a plus is to look at Pinterest and then I just wrote them down on the strips and you know you can even come up with your own or create your own number that's up to you and then this is what they look like and then just simply put them in the jar and then work some people want me to be heads or tails I say no way try again another day so to start off the bonsai bowl, what I'm going to do is start by cutting some fresh strawberries or any type of fruit that you would like to use. I just prefer strawberries because strawberries are honestly one of my favorite fruit. And you're just going to cut those up into little strips and then this is what they look like. And I'm going to be using my Ninja to blend all this up. So you're going to need um, some scoops of frozen yogurt and this is in vanilla. And I used about four scoops and then also add your frozen fruits as well. You can also use whatever kind I just use the triple berry mix and then I added some almond milk which this is totally up to you but I like it and then some ice I actually would recommend getting this crushed um, and then just put the lid on your ninja and then just blend it all up and might I add the consistency it does take some time so just be patient um, it took me a couple tries and then of course adding um, some more almond milk in between and then go ahead and add it into your bowl and this is what it looks like. I love it and it's so good. And then um, I would recommend smoothing out the tops and then go ahead and add your strawberries or whatever type of fruit you like to use. Um, I try to make it de look decorative but it never turns out that way. Um, and then I also just take some granola and put that on top as well. And then this is what it looks like. It is literally so good and I'm obsessed with it and you guys should definitely try it out. Sorry if I seem uninterested or I'm not listening or I'm indifferent, truly I ain't Now this is so good, detox water is literally the best. I'm cutting up some kiwi and I, yes I am leaving the skin on. It actually provides you with a lot of nutrients and then cutting up some fresh strawberries as well. Um, and then just adding water into my nice gold fish tumbler cup and then adding my strawberries, kiwis, and just simply, you know, mixing it around with a knife or a spoon and then shaking it up. And it is so good and it will literally clear you up and it is, oh my gosh, it's delicious. You should definitely try it. I've never wished on hope, didn't need a telescope. 
Now I'm gonna show you some of my favorite you know, workouts. Now I love doing push-ups. I can only do about 10. Mountain climbers, I could literally do four days and they're so much fun. Also, I love doing crunches where you go to the side, to the middle, to the side, to the middle, and back to the side over and over again. And those are fun. Also squats because we need to be perky. Just kidding. Um, squats are definitely fun to do. Jumping jacks are my favorite. They are so easy and like they get me ready and pumped. Also stretching. I think stretching is really like helpful to the body and it just gets you ready for the day. Also lunges are great for you know nice toned legs. Those are always fun. And then the scissors. This literally has my legs in pain today. And of course you can run or jog. I prefer jogging because I can't run worth the crap. Hope all those ideas were helpful to you but now let's get into my top five tips and tricks for getting and staying fit so the first tip is to definitely eat healthier maybe switch out a garbage snack for a really healthy one say you like fries um, go ahead and substitute that in maybe for some zucchini fries you can make those really easily and they're so good and they're so healthy and they're probably my favorite now you can just switch out any type of food during the day or drink I think that right there will definitely make a difference in helping you stay fit I think eating healthy is definitely a plus or eating healthier you don't have to completely change your diet but I say just switching some food or drinks out during the day will definitely help you reach the goal that you were trying to achieve the second tip is to take pictures of your progress and if you're anything like me I love taking pictures in my workout clothes plus taking pictures in general so why not just track your progress of how you were doing if you were trying to aim for getting abs or getting a tighter stomach which I am trying to aim for definitely take progress pictures because in the end you will thank yourself when you look back at those and be like wow I thought I was skinny then now look how toned and tight I am tip number three is to drink lots of water I love drinking water before I go to bed I usually drink one to two full bottles of water um, also drink them in the morning or you can just switch out say a can coke or a couple sodas a day for water and you will feel so much more energized and better and I feel like when I drink a bottle of water before I go to bed I wake up more energized and more awake and a lot easier trust me and I am not a morning person at all so drinking water before I go to bed and when I wake up is definitely a plus and a it just like it just helps your body with like detoxing it and getting rid of all like the nastiness I just feel like water is a really good advantage to our bodies tip number four is work out with a family member or friend now this might be weird I like to usually work out on my own but if you are not confident about working out in public by yourself Go ahead and grab a friend, you maybe call them up one day or a family member and go work out with them. I think it's so much fun. Plus you get to have nice talks and just things like that. So definitely call up your friend or family member and go work out with them. It's super fun and I've done it a couple times and I probably will do it again because it was just fun and a really good time. Plus if you go down to like the beach or a nice hike, it's just like you're in mother nature with someone you love and I just think that is really cool. Tip number five is to change your phone and computer backgrounds. Now you can find you know fitness inspired uh, pictures or quotes or really anything or you can even make your own collage for your computer and your phone. I think this really helps me stay motivated um, it just helps me want to like get up and like put on my workout clothes and like just go work out and just get a, like a little tone or like maybe a five or seven minute workout in. Um, it doesn't have to be like an hour long like go to the gym type thing. Um, so I think definitely changing my phone and background on my computer has definitely helped me stay motivated to better myself. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did make sure to give it a big thumbs up and subscribe down below. Also comment down below what other videos you guys want me to do once we move. I already have from now until I believe the 8th filmed and scheduled so any videos you guys want to see on Fridays after the 8th let me know um, and if you guys want to find out more about me moving I explained that in my last vlog and then also I explain it um, in next Tuesday's video because I am pre-filming. Anyways, thank you guys for watching and I will see you guys in next Tuesday's video. Bye! Hold up.